Hey guys, Kirby Vacuum Collector and Fixer here again. And uh, I have an idea. What I did was... Because I, I really don't want to film in my room every time and have to carry vacuums up and down stairs. So what I did was I got the extension cord and for... For... Um, for um, a little while, I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna use the extension extension cord that goes all the way up through the door into the hallway, and the hallway's like right above me, right here somewhere. <laughs> so, so I so I can still vacuum down here. Just um, and it'll be good because I won't be using any of the outlets down here because the outlets down here don't work. Last time I, last time I ever used an outlet down here I was plugging in my 508 and when I flipped the switch all the lights went out so it's probably not a good idea to use the outlets down here so here we go by the way I'm just using a couple vacuums I'm not it's not really on one vacuum I'm really using those two That's the Royal. Um, I'll do the Hoover next. And again, the Hoover, um, it works good. It has a good motor. It just uh, doesn't have a, like the brush roll doesn't spin. But that's the only problem. Otherwise, it's perfect working order. Here has a good motor, just no spin, no brush roll. I'll show you. No brush, the brush roll doesn't spin. Um, now I'm not sh quite sure, but I think this Hoover is from like the earlier mid 90s because uh, the Sprint I grew up with came out in like the later 90s. Maybe going on early 2000s. Because there was the Elites, which uh, looked like this. And they had... The top was much thicker, like this. And... Um... Just a second. Mm. That was my dad. Um, he was just talking. But they had thicker tops like this. And they had a zipper on the side like this. Um, and the plastic usually had like like the handle and the plastic like this stuff was all gray and the base would be whatever color but like the handle and the top here would be gray the cords would usually be white on them and then with the sprint I had 
sprint, like Hoover sprints and Hoover runabouts were similar. They had like black handle. Um, they had usually a darker, like a black cord. They did not have zippers. They had a thinner top that, that you would slide and the bag would be open from the top. Plus the bags were wider. The bags on the sprints and runabouts would be about like that. And that's what I grew up with. Of a sprint. And the sprint, there was multiple sprints that were made at the same time. There was just a line of like from like the least like the most simple one up to the most advanced one. Like I've seen pictures. There's the most simple one, which is just a plain vacuum with no uh, no light, no carpet adjuster, um, just just vacuum. That's it. That's what we had. Just the the lowest of the lowest one in the line. And then there was another one which was like this, where it had the it was the same as ours, except it had the light in the uh, carpet setting, and then the highest one had the light, the carpet setting, and the hose with attachments. But really, I mean, they're all the same, just slight differences. The elites are similar, just I think they have less amps because the Hoover Sprints and Runabouts have a much higher pitch motor. Like, they sound the same as this, but with a much higher pitch motor. This has like a lower pitch motor, but with the same sound. Um... That's all I can do, because we're leaving for something, so enjoy, and thanks for watching.